Radio Luxembourg, that popular European radio station, decided to host a unique challenge. They put a hefty prize of 1 million francs, which by today's standards is equivalent to around $16,000, on the table. The challenge? Transport a three-ton ice block from Norway, where it's chilly, to the sweltering Sahara Desert in Africa, all without using refrigeration. Crazy, right? Enter our hero, Bjarne Navik, a Norwegian insulation company manager. He saw this challenge as the ultimate opportunity to showcase his company's products and gain worldwide recognition. So he assembled a team of engineers, drivers, and a mechanic, and they set off on their ambitious mission. Our journey starts in the picturesque Norwegian town of Moirana. There, our intrepid adventurers carefully extracted the ice block from a glacier. Imagine the scene, massive chunks of ice, weighing 200 kilograms each, ready for their epic voyage. But oh boy, the team faced some serious challenges. The ice block started melting under the relentless African sun. Their trusty truck got stuck in the sand more times than they could count. And let's not forget the treacherous terrain and the ever-present threat of rebels. It was like an action movie, but with ice. But guess what? Despite the odds, Navik and his team persevered. After 28 grueling days, they finally reached their destination, Gardaia, Algeria. And here's the jaw-dropping part, 2,714 kilograms, 6,000 pounds of the ice block remained intact. Talk about ingenuity and determination. Now, Radio Luxembourg might have retracted their initial prize offer, but Navik's accomplishment had already made him and his company Glasvold household names. Their insulation materials gained widespread recognition, and Navik's story became an inspiration for many. So, my friends, the tale of the ice block challenge reminds us of the power of human determination. It's proof that we can overcome seemingly insurmountable obstacles, teamwork, innovation, and the pursuit of seemingly impossible goals. Those are the real heroes here.